Here we go. Not one but two Cinderella's are facing one another for a trip to the Final Four in San Antonio. Number nine, Kansas State versus number 11, Loyola Chicago. This is the first time an 11 seed meets a 9 seed in NCAA history. Loyola's Marcus Towns drive to the rim and find Dante Ingram for the corner three. Good ball movement by the Ramblers. Ben Richardson from the outside for three. And on to an 11-0 run for the Ramblers. Later on, Kansas State, Barry Brown Jr. finds Xavier Sneed for the three. Next up, Barry Brown Jr. with a step back jumper from the baseline. This ain't what you want. Let's take another look at it. Barry Brown finishes with 16 points on the night, bringing the lead down to seven. Kansas State, 12 points off turnovers in the first half. Clayton Custer finds Lucas Williamson, cutting to the rim, banks in the layup with the foul. Good shot. Before the end of the half, Custer finds Ben Richardson in the corner for three, giving the Ramblers a nine point lead. Loyola are 23 0 leading at the half this year. They are 36 24 at half halftime. Second half, Richardson for three again and comes down with a foul for the four point play. Loyola goes up 15. Next, Marcus Towns dishes to Cameron Crutwig over two defenders. Nice pass. Ramblers were on fire last night. Richardson hands off to Custer for another three. That makes it 50 to 33. Ramblers made nine three pointers on the night. Kansas State, Carmel Stokes drives to the rim, and what a tough finish. That cuts the lead down to 13 with just five minutes left in the game. Kansas State trying to hang around in this game. The Rumblers won't on a mission tonight. Custer to Richardson for the three. Finishes with six three-pointers, 23 points on the night, and Vince Williamson dishes to Towns, who drives and makes the layup with contact on the play, and he's fired up. He finishes with 13 points, and Loyola Chicago is heading to the Final Four for the first time since 1963 National Championship. They're going to win it, 78-62.